by Tabula by Tabula Sponsored Links Sponsored Links Promoted Links Promoted Links Lewis Delaware This brilliant, tiny company is disrupting a $200 billion industry ever quote insurance quotes ever quote insurance quotes unnerving mysterious photos that cannot be explained it's the vibe it's the vibe his story will be made tonight when WWE's first women's Royal Rumble match is held alongside the traditional 30-man contest. Both of the epic battle royals will offer the winners a shot at either Raw or SmackDown Live's world titles at WrestleMania 34. Raw's Universal Champion Brock Lesnar will defend his belt against Braun Strowman and Kane in a triple threat encounter. The odds are against SmackDown's WWE Champion when he faces Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn in a two-on-one handicap match. Unlikely duo Seth Rollins and Jason Jordan put their Raw Tag Team Championship on the line against rivals Cesaro and Sheamus. And Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin will challenge the Usos for their SmackDown tag team titles in a two out of three falls match. Meanwhile, there are three bouts including a United States Championship Open Challenge on a special two-hour kickoff pre-show. Here is a match-by-match -match breakdown of the show. Six-man tag team match Kalisto, Lince Dorado, and Grand Metalik vs. TJP, Gentleman Jack Gallagher, and Drew Gullick WWE 205 Live Superstars Kalisto, Lince Dorado and Grand Metalik square off against TJP, Gentleman Jack Gallagher Drew Gullick in a six-man tag team match which will likely signal the start of the night's in-ring action. WWE's cruiserweight division is currently in disarray, due to the firing of WWE cruiserweight champion Enzo Amore. On 205 Live on Tuesday, Daniel Bryan revealed an announcement will be made next week about the title and the identity of a new general manager for the troubled brand, which was already reeling from the loss of mainstays Neville, Austin Aries and Richard Swan last year, plus a recent injury to veteran performer the Bryan Kendrick. Hopefully this revamp will mark a new direction for the show, which has failed to live up to expectations. WWE need to find new stars to lead 205 Live and the charismatic Drew Gullick is one performer who could help with this transition. He along with Manchester's Gallagher and former champion TJP should get the win here over the masked luchadors. Predicted winners, TJP, Gentleman Jack Gallagher, and Drew Gullick singles match for the WWE United States Championship Bobby Roode C vs. TBD Bobby Roode was a logical choice to be the new WWE United States Champion, having carried much of the momentum he built as NXT Champion with him to Tuesday nights on SmackDown Live. The glorious one edged out Jinder Mahal to triumph in a tournament for the vacant strap that was originally set to conclude at tonight's pay-per-view, after Dolph Ziggler surrendered the title in bizarre circumstances after capturing it at Clash of Champions in a triple threat against Roode and Baron Corbin. The obvious choice to answer this open challenge would therefore be Ziggler, as the show-off has feuded with Rude since his promotion to the main roster. But perhaps Mahal, yet to be officially confirmed as an entrant in the Men's Royal Rumble, will step up to the plate once again. If that is the case, don't be surprised if the modern-day Maharaja ends Rude's title reign almost as soon as it has begun, in a move that would regain some status for the ex-WWE champion. However, not knowing Bobby's opponent makes it hard to look beyond the champion as the expected winner. Predicted winner, Bobby Roode Tag Team Match Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson vs. The Revival Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder Hot On. The heels of a confrontation at the Manhattan Center at Raw 25 on Monday, The Revival lock horns again with Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. Dash Wilder and Scott Dawson will want to avenge the loss they suffered at the hands of the Baylor Club members and the humiliating beatdown that ensued by Finn Baylor and assorted members of Degeneration X. These are two very hard-hitting duos and this should be a bruising encounter, which could well be the highlight of the kickoff pre-show if they are given time to display the kind of ability we saw from them on a regular basis in NXT and New Japan Pro Wrestling respectively. Dawson missed six months of action because of a torn right bicep last August, but the revival remain a tremendous prospect. They need to get back on track with a win over the former Raw Tag Team Champions this evening. Predicted winners, the revival 30-woman Royal Rumble match for a women's championship match at WrestleMania 34 2018 Women's Royal Rumble match One of the two Rumble matches will presumably open the main card and what better way to start proceedings than with the inaugural women's event. Television host Maria Menounos will be the special guest ring announcer and Royal Commissioner Stephanie McMahon, who famously revealed the contest would take place, has been added to the commentary team. Hopefully that is the only significant part Stephanie will play in the match, as the spotlight needs to be firmly on the 30 female competitors aiming for a shot at either Alexa Bliss and her Raw Women's Championship or Charlotte Flair and her SmackDown Women's Championship.
Both rosters have recently been bulked out with new factions, rejoined by NXT's Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville, forming the heel group Absolution led by the injured Paige, and SmackDown by Ruby Riot, Live Morgan and Sarah Logan, aka Heel, stable the Riot squad. Both of these groups shall no doubt team up to try and dominate the field, before at some stage coming face to face with each other. The roster for the match will also no doubt be boosted by some familiar faces from NXT, perhaps either one or both of the iconic duo, Peyton Royce and Billy Kay. Fans will also expect to see some divas from yesteryear, with members of the group who appeared on Raw 25 at the top of the list, Trish Stratus, Tori Wilson, Michelle McCool, Jacqueline, Terry Runnels and Kelly Kelly, or the rumored ex-WWE women's champion, Molly Holly. It would be a surprise to see Stratus compete again after all this time, but McCool and Holly seem real possibilities. Could a figure like Lita, oddly and perhaps strategically not a part of the Raw 25 celebrations, be the show-stopping return red-blooded males may simply opt for Tori having seen the 42-year-old somehow look even more stunning than in her youth last Monday night. The winner of the bout should come from the nucleus of talents who hold up the women's divisions, discounting the likes of Carmella, who does not need the win as she holds the money in the bank briefcase. Unless we see a shock appearance by UFC legend Ronda Rousey, long rumored to be joining WWE, that leaves one of Naomi, Asuka, Natalya, Sasha Banks, Bayley, Nia Jax, or Becky Lynch as the likeliest winners. Expect strong showings by Jax and Banks in particular, but the two frontrunners seem to be Asuka and Lynch. Bliss is running scared from the undefeated former NXT Women's Champion Asuka. But a showdown between the pair could easily be set up elsewhere. More intriguing would be the two best friends Lynch and Charlotte set on a collision course thanks to a win for the Liss Kicker, which could facilitate a heel turn for Flair and see a classic outing between the two best women's wrestlers on SmackDown come WrestleMania. Predicted winner, Becky Lynch Tag Team Match for the WWE Raw Tag Team Championship Seth Rollins and Jason Jordan C vs. Cesaro and Sheamus Seth Rollins tag team partner Dean Ambrose was storyline injured by Samoa Joe last month, as way of explanation for a torn tricep, which means we may not see the lunatic fringe again until the autumn. The following week, Raw general manager Kurt Angle instead had his son, Jason Jordan, and Rollins team up to face Cesaro and Sheamus for the Raw tag team championship, which they won. The Bard demanded a rematch and that has been set for tonight, after a couple of weeks of the upstart Jordan antagonizing the European pairing. Rollins and his buddy in the Shield, Roman Reigns, have both been less than impressed with Jordan's attitude, and WWE is teasing a split between Seth and Jason leading to a singles clash. Jordan has learned well from Angle, portraying a character that harks back to the Olympic gold medalist's early days, which is wonderfully lacking in self-awareness. WWE needs to run with this plot for a while yet and despite rumors of Jason carrying an injury, they need to just survive with their titles here. Predicted winners, Seth Rollins and Jason Jordan handicap match for the WWE Championship AJ Styles C vs. Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn One title that definitely should not change hands is the WWE Championship, which currently resides around the waist of AJ Styles. The phenomenal one undeniably belongs in one of the two main events at WrestleMania. But this contest needs to facilitate the next step in the ongoing saga involving SmackDown Commissioner Shane McMahon's rivalry with Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, which has now seen the Blue Brand's general manager Daniel Bryan added to the mix. At Clash of Champions, they both refereed a tag team match pitting Owens and Zayn against Randy Orton and Shinsuke Nakamura, where Owens and Zayn would have been fired if they lost. After Shane let his hatred for Owens get the better of him, Bryan gave a fast count for Owens and Zayn to win. Since then, Owens and Zayn have both defeated Styles with each other's help, prompting AJ to state that he might as well face them both in a handicap match. Brian therefore made this handicap match, again adding weight to the idea that he favors the heel duo. Now there is a real prospect of Owens and Zayn becoming the first code WWE champions, but surely Shane OMAC will not allow that to happen. This should be a fun encounter with plenty of thrills and spills, concluding with perhaps both Brian and Shane interfering and AJ just escaping with the most prestigious title in all of WWE. Predicted winner, AJ Styles 2 out of 3 falls match for the WWE SmackDown Tag Team Championship The Usos J and Jimmy USOC vs. Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin no tag team had a more impressive 2017 than the Usos, the highlight of which was a barnstorming feud with the New Day, culminating in one of the all-time great Hell in a Cell matches. Sadly, Jimmy USO may have undone some of their hard work with a recent run-in with the law. Whether they are 
punished by losing the titles remains to be seen, but there's a possibility they would have dropped the belts to Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin anyway. Gable and Benjamin defeated the Usos on the first SmackDown of 2018 to initially win the titles after pinning Jimmy, however, he was not the legal man and the match restarted and was clinched by the Samoan brothers. After questioning Daniel Bryan if they should have to defeat the Usos twice in the same night, he decided the Usos would defend the straps against them in a two out of three falls match. With the burgeoning potential of Gable and the vast experience and quality of the other three men involved, this should be a cracking match. Predicted winners, Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin triple threat match for the WWE Universal Championship Brock Lesnar C with Paul Heyman vs. Braun Strowman vs. Kane ever since Roman Reigns retired The Undertaker and Brock Lesnar recaptured the Universal Championship from Goldberg at WrestleMania 33 last April, everything has pointed to a WrestleMania 34 showdown between the Big Dog and the Beast Incarnate. The problem with such a clearly telegraphed mega match is that it's hard to get excited about title defenses that take place in the meantime, even if the obstacles are as gargantuan as Braun, Strowman and Kane. The past encounter between Lesnar and Strawman at No Mercy in September failed to live up to expectations, while oddly given the long tenure of both men, neither Brock nor Kane have had a singles match before at pay-per-view. WWE's answer to this dilemma so far has been to have Braun wreak even more havoc than normal, tipping steel rigging onto Lesnar in the big red machine, then flipping over a truck. With the exception of the aforementioned Goldberg, very few superstars have shown as much dominance over Lesnar, which is all part of a bid to make Brock look at genuine risk of losing his belt to the monster among men. Whether that is a genuine possibility is an interesting discussion, could WWE give Braun a brief title run until Elimination Chamber, when Lesnar could regain the belt, ready to face Reigns on April 8th that would be one way of avoiding what looks like a predictable win for the ex-UFC heavyweight champion. Predicted winner, Brock Lesnar 2018 Men's Royal Rumble match Everything that has just been said about Lesnar and Reigns means many fans expect WWE to once again disappoint a large section of its following by having Roman win the Men's Royal Rumble match. The controversial Samoans win in 2015 was deeply unpopular and the last two Rumbles have seen crowds rejoice mainly because Triple H and Randy Orton pipped him to victory. The chances of the night ending with the new face of WWE pointing at the WrestleMania sign appear strong indeed, especially as he lost the Intercontinental Championship to The Miz on Raw 25, seemingly in preparation for a main event run. But there are other options available to WWE, even if bookers ultimately want to see the former Shield man square off with Brock at the show of shows. The biggest name confirmed for this year's field is undoubtedly John Cena, the man whom Reigns has replaced as the company's favorite son. He recently had a run-in with Elias that ended with the sinister songsmith smashing a guitar over his head, so they should come to blows at some stage during the match. An even bigger name loosely rumored to join the match is the legendary Undertaker, yet it seems unlikely that the dead man will mark his return to action after more than nine months as an unadvertised surprise in the Rumble. Bobby Lashley, once seen as the future of the WWE by Vince McMahon, is now a free agent, after the XECW world champion quit Impact Wrestling following a six-year spell when he held the promotion's top title four times. He could well be the shock return of the night, aside from the usual assorted Hall of Famers appearing for a nostalgia pop, or if we dare, to dream, top WWE UK talents like Pete Dunne or Tyler Bate. The remaining credible contenders can be narrowed down to perhaps three men, one of whom can be discounted following his win last year and a dismal subsequent title run, the fading Orton. The Viper is still capable of brilliance when motivated and paired with the right opponent, but his grim feuds with Bray Wyatt and Jinder Mahal severely knocked his standing. That leaves two huge stars of tomorrow and two former NXT champions, Ross Finn Balor and SmackDown's Shinsuke Nakamura. Baylor is the inaugural winner of the Universal Championship, who never lost the title but immediately had to surrender it due to injury following his win over Seth Rollins at SummerSlam 2016, and thanks to the machinations of others, has never had a proper shot at regaining it. If Gallows and Anderson reappear in the Rumble, they could help the grinning Irishman advance to the final stages of the match. Regardless, he should be part of the Final Four, because no matter what anyone thinks, he is resoundingly over with a WWE Universe. The enigmatic Nakamura's main roster run has been nothing short of a disappointment, with the rock star soon losing his luster when paired with the inexperienced Corbin and the blundering Mahal last summer.
The highlight for Shinsuke last year was a brief confrontation with AJ Styles in the Money of the Bank ladder match when fans pined to see the X and JPW rivals rekindle one of the greatest modern rivalries. Neither men are spring chickens, Styles is 40, and Nakamura is 37, so the time is probably now if we are going to get to see a 25-minute masterclass between the pair at WrestleMania. A win for Nakamura would thrust him back into the spotlight and set the stage for a mat classic in New Orleans. Predicted winner, Shinsuke Nakamura video will play and watch again wrestling legend Ric Flair discusses winning the WWE title at the 1992 Royal Rumble share this video watch next we pay for stories. Send your videos to video at trinitymirror.com full card Kalisto, Lince Dorado, and Grand Metalik vs. TJP, Gentleman Jack Gallagher, Andrew Golick, six-man tag team match Bobby Roode C vs. TBD, singles match for the WWE United States Championship Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson vs. The Revival Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder, tag team match 2018 Women's Royal Rumble match 30 Woman Royal Rumble match for a Women's Championship match at WrestleMania 34 Seth Rollins and Jason Jordan C vs. Cesaro and Sheamus, tag team match for the WWE Raw Tag Team Championship AJ Styles C vs. Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, handicap match for the WWE Championship The Usos J and Jimmy USO C vs. Chad Gable and Shelton Benjamin 2 out of 3 falls match for the WWE SmackDown Tag Team Championship Brock Lesnar C with Paul Heyman vs. Braun Strowman vs. Kane, triple threat match for the WWE Universal Championship 2018 Men's Royal Rumble match 30 Men Royal Rumble match for a World Championship match at WrestleMania. 34 Watch WWE Royal Rumble 2018 Live on the WWE Network or on Sky Sports Box Office at midnight on Sunday, January 28. You can follow all the action as it happens in the Mirror Sport WWE Royal Rumble Live blog.